Salam alaikum ninjas and welcome back, welcome back. Check it out, uh, new uh, basically new gaming review of a new rugged device, a new chip, Halo G99 uh, in my hands. You're gonna have the buying links in the description. What a beautiful, unique, powerful uh, rugged device. Unique, uh, original, interesting, uh, uh, kind of maybe a little bit, uh, let's just say weird for some of you, uh, but for some of you maybe it's gonna look so cool, bro. Check it out guys, the setup on the background, uh, secondary display on the back, which is insane, man, seriously insane, which you can use for different purposes, for camera, audio player, watch, uh, of course, compass, uh, notifications, battery, I mean, a lot of stuff, man, a lot of stuff to do. So, nevertheless, we're gonna leave that for the full review. This is a gaming review of this device. Uh, let me just show you right now the specs. I'm having here 12 12 GB RAM, hi uh, guys. 12 GB RAM of, uh, but that, that is insane. That is seriously insane. Let me just go now and show you the device information. It's more accurate regarding that. This is the Halo G99 MediaTek 6789V, an octa core chip, guys, uh, and has Mali G57. Check it out, Mali G57. It's going to be very interesting. So let's begin with this video. The buying links will be in the description to purchase this rugged device on AliExpress.com, and maybe the links will be not yet available when I release this gaming. So just follow my YouTube channel, guys because this is just a phone which not it was not even released. I have an opportunity and honor to be the first guy to review this device or online, guys. And big, big shout out for the Okitel company, seriously. Props out, guys. Let's go. What beautiful, man. That's a very beautiful rugged device, bro. Firstly, we're gonna begin with the Call of Duty. Let's go. Here we go, guys. What I love about this device that this is my first rugged device ever. And I'm testing that it has a, such a large display, almost 6.8 inches, guys. And it has 120 hertz screen. 120 hertz, guys. You can choose 60 hertz, you can choose 90 hertz, or 120 hertz. And that's the first rugged device in the world, if I'm not wrong, to have the, all these specs. Insane battery, 10,000, almost 10,000, I mean, battery 9,800. 60, uh, 65, 67 watts f super fast charging support, which is crazy. Check it out this experience, guys. Also, the touch here with the rugged uh, with the rugged device is very good, man. It's an admirable level. Ah, oh, he killed me with the sniper, bro. Call of Duty is running amazing here with the with the Halo G99, bro. I think that most of you will agree with me that this is an amazing frame rate, amazing speed. Let's go. Nice, I love this. Let's go next. Okay, guys, uh, now we are playing World War Heroes, which uh, is running crazy. Uh, that is nuts. I think this is running on maybe normal mode. Let me just go to the settings, graphics, uh, average. Let's go to the low. And believe it or not, this game is uncapped, guys. It can run up to, I don't know, maybe 144 FPS. Uh, you can see myself right now that it can reach, uh, there you go, let me show you, 90 FPS. Crazy man, the game can reach 120 FPS. This is a heavy game, guys. This is a heavy game. You need to have a flagship chip for this game, bro. Uh, it's a heavy game, specifically right now, especially now if you are obviously having a 120 or 144 hertz screen that can support a, a, a higher frame rate, because you need to have... Oh my God, that's heavy. I didn't even know that this game supports an uncapped uh, frame rate. That's very nice. Let's go next. I'm amazed. I'm amazed by this chip. Halo G99 is a great gaming chip, bro. Uh, obviously, it needs more optimization. Uh, altogether, most of these games, they will need more optimization. This is, this is a new chip, guys. Let's go with the Apex Legends also. Why not? There we go. So we get high frame rate, uh, graphic quality normal. Okay. Okay, guys, Apex Legends. You can see myself the frame rate on the top left corner. 
Nice bad man, this is a maybe um, entry level mid range chip. So what, 350,000 and 2 to score? I think they can, we, we can still call a chip which scores more than 300,000 a mid range chip. Example, Kirin 970, in my opinion, it's a mid range chip, guys, for level, and it also scores around 350, the Kirin 970. Not bad at all. Let's even lower resolution down a little bit. Smooth. There we go. We go next. Asphalt nine. As we know, asphalt nine uh, needs more optimization for MediaTek chipsets, and I think they're gonna update it. By the way, uh, it's limited at 30 FPS. This game is limited at 30 FPS. Uh, most of the MediaTek chipsets are limited at 30 FPS. Why? Because of the game developers, obviously. They don't care that much for optimizing it for uh, non-Snapdragon processors. I think Exynos and Snapdragon runs it really good, but other chipsets... I don't know. Still very nice, man. It's a really good performance. Beautiful. Awesome stuff. I'm gonna try to disable the try test drive. Wow. That's too much man smoke. <laughs> Let's go next. Okay, this is bullet force. Amazing frame rate, amazing frame rate. Guys, let's finish this gaming review with the PUBG gameplay. So far, the phone doesn't overheat. Amazing speakers, amazing brightness, amazing screen. Let me go to NS64, check the thermals. Please check this out. The phone is cold, completely cold. This Helio G99, guys, it's an amazing chip. See, it's an amazing chip. It doesn't drain battery that much. Maybe it's not obviously powerful. Uh, like, I don't know, maybe Dimensity 900 series or Dimensity 1000 series, but it's uh, for its price tag with a rocket device, it's amazing chip. Beautiful. Let's go to PUBG for the end. Awesome stuff, man. How to enable the clock? There you go. Double tap. So cool. So cool. Okay, Jess, this is the PUBG test right now with the Octel WP21 Halo G99. Uh, by the way, this is the maximum graphics that you can get, uh, ultra frame rate, balanced or HD high. I will be trying also to use, uh, I'll be using maybe GFX tool if it's going to be able to use with the Halo G99. So this is the Halo G99 latest uh, MediaTek chip. Uh, and then with 12 GB of RAM, Android 12, almost 6.8 uh, inch screen, full HD screen guys, 120 Hz. Uh, insane, insane beast guys. Almost 10,000 mAh battery, almost 10,000 mAh battery, 60 watts, 67 watts fast charging technology, uh, 65 megapixel Sony uh, camera on the back. I mean, so many great things about this device, it's absolutely crazy, bro. So it's not running 60 FPS, it's capped at 45 FPS. That's why you see uh, that it's not running that, uh, that smooth. 
Let's check it out. Okay, it's very smooth here with the, the car. Love what I'm seeing right now. The graphics are amazing, man. I can't believe that we can get these kind of graphics here with the G Halo G99. PUBG get optimized very good, bro. Check it out, guys. Idiot, go away. Let's go. Beautiful. Seriously beautiful. Nice, let's exit. Very loud speakers, guys. Very loud speakers. Let's exit. Oh, I couldn't destroy it. Okay, now, just a minute. Let's go, let's go. Nice. Shotgun left. Amazing, very smooth guys, it's a 45 FPS here, uh, anyway Halo G99, probably they will need to release a new update for this chip since uh, it's a new chip processor, this is the first time I'm even testing this processor guys, I think maybe this is the first phone to have this chip, uh, but I might be wrong bro. Wow, that is so cool, let's go with the gun. Check it out guys. Let's go. Okay, let's go next.